All righty, we've been telling you all morning long, ready to challenge to try, well, Baltimore's hottest burrito. We got John Murphy from Salsarita Fresh Cantina sharing the rare recipe and reveals the secret hot, hot, hot ingredients. And uh, we're going to serve this on up right. Uh, you guys are downtown, right? Uh, 324 West Baltimore Street. And who's our official roller here today? It's Kevin Gray. It's Kevin, that's right. So we got Kevin rolling. We got Sean going to be talking about it. And why do you guys make claim to this as we, as we get you rolling? And tell us a little bit about why this is indeed Baltimore's hottest. What do you do? I secret mean, well, our secret ingredient would be our Grim Reaper mash hot sauce. And that's pretty much make our burrito what it is. It's only the one that's in Baltimore City, so it's pretty hot. Grim Reaper kind of sends out a, a wave that, hey, that's as hot as it gets when the Grim Reaper comes uh, calling <laughs> to your burrito. Why don't you start rolling for us, Kev? And now, when you, do you just serve up this, the world's hottest, or Baltimore's hottest, or do you serve variation? Say folks who say, I can't handle the heat. What do you do? Do you just have uh, one type of ingredient or add extra little sauce to it? Well, I mean, our ingredients come basic, you know, chicken, rice, black beans, little cilantro, corn sauce, and onions. Now, if you, you want to alternate it, you can, but that's just what you get. If you can't handle it, then stay out of <laughs> the kitchen. Can't, if you can't stand the heat, get out of the kitchen. Yeah, yeah. You guys are rolling. Now, tell us what, Kevin, some of these specific ingredients you Well, some in ingredients, here. you know, it start with basic Mexican rice with garlic and tomatoes. Mm -hmm. Then we go with the simple black beans, and we got chicken, simple base, a little bit of onions, dash of onions. Um, we got white corn, black beans, and a little bit of tomatoes, and a pinch of cilantro, and a two ounce of Grim Reaper hot sauce. Now that's one looking big burrito. Is that your individual size burrito? Yes. Really? Mm -hmm. You would think, uh, I guess, a guy my size could handle that, but you think two folks, that might be for two, enough for two with all that I mean, it all depends on your appetite. Yeah. Know, but that's the, how it comes. Now when folks come in there and they're saying, oh yeah, I've had hot burritos before, have you had any that uh, have really been surprised and have had to get put the fire out because well, of the... Yeah, to my knowledge, you know, we had two people who ch tried the challenge, and we also offer a free um, T-shirt when you're doing promotion. But, yeah, it's pretty hot. All right. Well, you know, I, they've been saying all morning long that I have to be the tester of this. So, why don't you, well, why don't we cut off a little piece with the, with the fork? Because <laughs> if just, just in the event it gets too hot, I have to say something after this. I have to do the weather. So, I'm going to say goodbye and thank you to these guys. But first... One last, just a little bite here. And I'll be honest with you, if I can handle heat, and I'll tell you if I can get out of the kitchen. Well, I'm going to get right to it here and let you. Mm. Yeah. The Grim Reaper has cometh. And I have to talketh. And I thank you guys for coming. All right. Hope I don't melt your... Uh, TV screen, but there's some heat coming out right now. For more information, I have milk here. Wow. Now head to our website, foxbaltimore.com slash morning.